Hello guys, welcome to Microsoft ASP.NET MVC tutorial on how to create authentication, login process, registration process and session. We are in part 4 describing about session. Let's start. At first we are in home controller. In home controller we have already done registration process, login process and authentication now we are going to perform session so that when session is preserved user will not have to uh, type his username or password every time for that session period it will automatically redirect to the main page let's start to create a session we are in home controller and in login action result when user first arrives to login page this return view will show the login page and when user types his username and password and hits the uh, login button then the user passed username and password will be provided to this method where user object will get that username and password which I have already described in previous tutorials also now when user is authenticated when this user logged in uh, has some value which will not be null if user has typed correct username and password at that situation we are redirecting the user to main page before that we are going to make a session variable let's start for this we'll use a session then inside the session inside big bracket a string will be required we will give username okay now username will have value user dot username that is user provided username okay this line of code will create a session in our app this one line of code is sufficient to create a session okay now check the session and redirect the page wherever required now in login when the user has already logged in then in that case we don't have to show the login page again and again in such scenario we'll use that session and redirect them to main page directly we have main page which will be return from here that is main page now let's check that session here if session username is not equals to null that is username is already defined then we will redirect the page to we will redirect the page to main page that is main page is our action home is our controller with a parameter username equals to session username that is the value uh, kept in that session which has variable username and we need to convert that to a string if username is null then we will just pass the view of login as before just put it here this much code will work the session now this is for login page now let's make that session recognized in our main page also if session username is equals to null then we need to redirect our page to login of home controller and we don't need any parameter there and put 
this thing here now this much for session this much code will work for our session let's check it out while this loads up let's check our code again in login page if session is already there we are logged in facebook page and when you type uh, facebook.com then it will redirect you to home page not the login page similarly here if user tries to go to login page at that time if user had already logged in before in that scenario we will redirect the user to main page instead of that login page okay and next uh, when user pass the username and password while authenticating will create a session at first session will be created in this moment mm, at last when user directly hits the main page if the user was not already logged in at that time we have to redirect the user to login page in this way that is if session username is null then we will redirect them to login page otherwise we will simply uh, send them to main page let's check it out now let's type our home controller login login action now when I type wrong username it will obviously will not will not get logged in for that to be uh, for the session to be created we must um, provide correct username and password let's check it the session has been created and it has redirected us to main page with parameter username equals to because now let's go to login page again when we hit the login page again it must redirect us to main page again instead of showing the login page yes we now see that when we hit login page it is redirecting us to main page without typing this main page we are here let's see it again home log I have typed home login and it must redirect us to main page yes in this way we are redirected to main page and when we directly hit the main page suppose instead of login when we hit main page it will show the main page but when we go to login again it will also transfer us to main page with username because but when we hit directly that main page we are not getting username equals to because to make that happen let's add something here while returning to while directly going to main page mm, let's use instead of username we can use session username and get that username
session has expired here let's log in again here we are in main page which is name because now we will type main page again here instead of login let's type main page in this way also we are getting hello because in this way we can get the uh, session variable while working with session in login okay guys this much for today thanks for watching